بسم الله الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين I am honored to present to you a series of stories of our beloved Prophet Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم this great man that sometimes we neglect the other side of his life and we only think that he was just to give da'wah and to talk to people about Qur'an and about hidayah and guidance and of course that is part of his life however he did have the other human side within the Islamic values and that is to defend people and to protect people and to love people and to show passion and to show mercy whether with Muslims or non-Muslims we're gonna go through series of stories throughout the blessed month of Ramadan insha'Allah ta'ala and I have chosen this book that's called Golden Morals Golden Morals for Brother Abdul Malik Mujahid it's a beautiful book inshallah we're gonna go through it and the very first story it goes without saying is the story of love the story of love that Prophet Muhammad had deep love toward his first wife Khadija radiallahu anha wa ardaha so the beautiful relationship that Prophet Muhammad had with his wife 15 years of relationship before the message came down and when Jibreel alayhi salam came down to Prophet Muhammad وسلم, and instructed him that he is going to be the messenger of Allah and with the impact of such message and such surprise Prophet وسلم, naturally as a human being resorted to what we naturally resort to and that is he just ran down ran down to his comfort zone because he was just frightened and did not realize exactly what took place in the front of him so you would wonder for such a serious matter that would happen to someone and in a Bedouin and in a Arab society in a society of city of Mecca that is a city of masculine city of, of manhood you would think that Prophet Muhammad would go to his friends but rather he went to his wife a female because of the deep love and relationship that he entrusted within her and subhanallah indeed it was the best choice as he ran down frightened and he said take me in take me in cover me up cover me up she realized that there is something absolutely serious happened to her, her husband so she did not overreact with fear again and what's going on tell me exactly what happened and she would scare him more oh this is absolutely unacceptable this is so serious let's just run away let's just call the police let's just do and sometimes when we overreact we just worsen the situation but rather she immediately wanted to balance that serious incident that took place within her husband's heart and soul and she wanted to comfort him she said relax nothing is going to happen to you Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would never do you wrong look at you look who you are you are Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam you are the kind you are the passionate you are the one that is loved by everyone you are the one that look after the poor the needy the widows you are the one that walks in the market and everyone loves you are and you are and you are and she started reminding him of who he is and that he cannot be uh, forgotten or forsaked and he has to be supported by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala since Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala chose him for such message so that really brought comfort to Prophet Muhammad and that was extremely wise of Ummuna Khadija radiallahu anha wa ardaha that she brought that balance she allowed him to be comfortable comfortable and she allowed him to process what just took place with him so he can be ready for the message of guidance may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guide us to read about Prophet Muhammad and to love him more and more 
والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته